Hey, what's up guys? Johnny here back with another Call of Duty mobile video. Today, how to unlock the Sparrow. It's a brand new operator skill. It was added in the game a few days ago, but this week for the next 11 days, we have a challenge going on. It's an event. It's called the Sparrow event. So let's go guys and let's look into it. We're going to play some Call of Duty today. So it's pretty simple guys. You have 10 tasks, 10 things to do to unlock the sparrow and you have to do all 10. Now you see your event progress bar. Every time you complete two tasks, you will get rewards until the end and you will get the sparrow at the end. So it's pretty simple guys. You have to do team death match on standoff, 10 kills, 30 kills, 50 kills. It's gonna take a few games and use operator skill two times, four times. And I think you gotta get some kills. But then the last one, kill 100 enemies in multiplayer match. It doesn't have to be team dead match on standoff. So once you're done with the first few uh, tasks, you can go and farm some kills in domination if you want. It's pretty fast. And then you have a few battle royales uh, tasks. I did play yesterday. I didn't even know. But get 10 kills. Play three games. The last one, guys. Log in five days total. If you play every day, starting today, Nobody's going to get the Sparrow before Friday. Friday is going to be the fifth day uh, since the start of the event. So log in every day. If you miss a day or two, it's not a big deal because you have 11 days total. But you have to log in five times. Now here's a few tips for you guys. When you go on multiplayer, you can select your game mode. So choose Team that Match Confirm. And also uh, you might as well select your map. Instead of Random, go and choose Standoff Confirm. So you can go straight to team deathmatch on standoff and go farm your 50 kills. Now the big question guys is what's going to happen to the new players or the players that miss their chance at the Sparrow this week? Well my guess is probably it's going to be on the level up bar maybe very far. If you get max level you get the Sparrow. But the players that played in the event will unlock the Sparrow early. I guess that's that making a lot of sense right because... That would suck if you never get the Sparrow later because you missed your chance. I don't think it's a smart move for the dev to do something like that. So we will see pretty soon, I guess. So let's go and start working on that, guys. So I'll do some team that match on standoff and I'll go get my 50 kills and see what happens. All right, here we go, first game. I'm gonna go grenade. There's a kill, we need 49 more. Alright, we got a tight game and uh, operator still ready. First time in this session. We need a few kills today with that. There's two kills. No, that was not a kill. I got two so far. Alright, three kills with the first one. Alright guys, 37-37. First game of the day is a freaking close game. Lost the lead. 39. No. We lost by one. So first game of the day, 20 and 6, not bad at all. So 50 kills should take maybe 3 games. And I used the operator skill once in this game. So let's go for a second game. Here we go, game 2. Frag! Take it Enemy down. That was a nice nade at the start. That was not a kill, by the way. That's a kill. Target down. Oof. Enemy down. Very sick. Oh, UAV. UAV online. Wait, they're inside, right? Targets in sight. Tango down. 
Sentry yeah, we got sentry deployed. gun. That's Reloading. crazy. Friendly sentry gun deployed. Target down. And I get a few kills like that. Come on, dude, so close to the veto. But we're ahead at least this time. Enemy gun! Changing mag! Cover me! Tango down! Standing by. Repeat. UAV recon is standing by. Bro, it's only one kill, man. Two. That's gonna be it. UAV online. Tango down. Sentry gun down. Another sentry gun, dude. Keep on them. Two sentry gun this game. That's crazy good. So 21 and 3 this time, but I had a much better team. So let's do one more because I'm at like 40 something kills. I need 50 total in team that match. Here we go. One more time. Should be enough. I need 9 kills, I think, maybe. We've taken the lead. Still have no idea what happened there. Big double kill. We've taken the lead. A what? Sniper? Thought it was a butt, but it was not a butt, apparently. There we go. Revenge. Alright, ahead by two. I think I need kill a kill or two with that. There's one. There's two, we're good. I did all my challenges guys, but it's gonna be a loss. 20 to 32, it's almost over. Alright, definitely not my best game, 13 and 8. It feels like I'm alone with a bunch of bots versus two real players. The two games I lost, it really felt like I was 1v2 with bots. And like the two real players, they can just kill butts like crazy. Uh, you see all negative ratio on my team except myself and I'm only plus five. So it's tough to win these games. But all that matters is I did complete my challenges, guys. And let's see the progression on the Sparrow event. All right, so claim 10 kills in team that match on standoff. Then 30 kills on standoff team that match again. And I do have my first reward. It's an XP card. Then 50 kills in team that match. We're done. And use operator skill twice. Oh, I need to use one more. I'll have to play one more game, I guess. Um, yeah, I'll have to play one more game. And the six kills, though, I'm done. So one more game to get operator skill. But then I still need like 50 kills or something in multiplayer. It doesn't have to be team that match. So if I want, I can just go play some domination now. Get the 50 kills remaining and I will use the operator skill once at least uh, by the time I get 50 kills, like 46 kills. Then I'll have to play Battle Royale one more game and probably I'll be done. So that's pretty much it guys. Not a big deal. Pretty easy. You can do pretty much everything in about an hour. Uh, but the last one is going to be log in five days. So even if you do everything today... You cannot unlock the Sparrow until Friday, guys. So make sure you tune in next Friday. We'll do uh, some Sparrow gameplay. Now back to the Battle Pass, because just doing that, I did complete a few challenges on the weekly, because yesterday was Sunday, so we did get new challenges. I forgot to use the emote. Maybe next time I'll play Domination. I have to remember to use the emote. And then use the SMG for my next couple games, because there's a few challenges with SMGs. So guys, that's it for today. Let me know in the comments how you doing on the battle pass are you close to tier 100 i'll be pretty close when i'm done guys so once again thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed the video hit the like 
and subscribe to the channel for more Call of Duty Mobile videos. I will be back soon. Till then, watch my other stuff. Take care.